Hey guys, it's Amber, and today I'm going to show you how to make these custom mock-ups in Canva. Yes, I made all of these in Canva, and they do work. For this, you will need Canva Pro, so if you don't have Canva Pro, I'm so sorry, but without further ado, let's get into it. So, to get the mock-up, you cannot use a picture within Canva, so you can either generate one with AI or use something like Pixabay. So, as you can see from my searches, um, for example, I searched blank t-shirt. And you can just basically scroll until you find something you like. Um, there are tons, obviously, to choose from, and a lot of them are AI generated as well. Um, I already downloaded mine, so we're just gonna use those. Then you're gonna upload it to your design, and you can remove the background if you want. I think it just looks more real if you don't. And then you're gonna keep the picture selected, then go to apps, search mockup and click on Canva's mockup app. And then you'll see right here on the left, create a mockup template is gonna pop up and you'll click on that. And now with the use of Canva's AI, it is going to generate template frames for whatever parts it sees fit to create frames. So I've seen it do hair, pants, shirts, whatever. And so as you can see, it cuts out the background, does pants or a shirt, but since we want the shirt, that is what we're gonna click on. And then we're gonna co go to confirm And then there you have it. You can just drag any image you want into the frame. And so I'm just gonna pick out t-shirt design, see what comes up under graphics. Uh, let's just give her something cool, I guess, but obviously you can import your own designs. And so it's gonna make it super large. Oh, actually not sure what happened there. So we're gonna take that away. Let's give her this, this astronaut. Okay, so the sizing is a little off, so you're going to have to cl double click into your picture. And then on the left, you can resize your design and apply changes. You might have to do this a couple of times just to get it in the right position. That looks pretty good in my opinion, so we're going to keep it like that. And there's our first t-shirt mock-up. Now for the second one, same process. You just take your photo, whether it is AI generated or not, then apps, mockups, custom mockup template. And again, we're gonna choose the shirt and then let's give him something on theme. <laughs> that looks goofy. So we're gonna look and see if we can find something else. That's almost good. Like I said, you might have to fiddle a little bit with the sizing, unfortunately. I think that's about as good as it's going to get for his t-shirt. But you can also do this with products. So we're going to go ahead and take this coffee cup mock-up and do the same thing again and select the version of the mock-up we want. And then let's see if we can find something good. Hmm. Let's try this floral one. Not bad. I like that one. <laughs> Anyways, that is how you make your own custom mock-ups within Canva. You can export these and reuse them for your shop. I think the possibilities are really endless and I've only been playing around with this for about 10 minutes. So definitely let me know what type of mock-ups you plan on making with this and I hope this helped. See you in the next video.